welcome back to my channel in today's video we will learn about flowchart to print numbers from 1 to 10 so let's start first we will create a start symbol of an oval shape after that we will read the input as variable n read n you can take any variable of your choice. After this process, we will initialize the value of n equals to 1. To do this, we will use a process box set n equals to 1. After this, we will check the condition whether n is less than 10 or not using a decision box of diamond shape if n is less than or equals to 10 there will be two condition two scenario whether true or false whether yes or no in the no case the loop will stop or end and in the yes case it will print the value of n print n and after doing this it will increment the value of n by 1. n equals to n plus plus or you can write this as n plus plus n plus 1 or n plus plus and this is also known as increment now this process of incrementation and checking the condition will repeat until the condition is false so this process to increment and again checking so we are directing here to condition checking will only stop if the value of n will not meet the condition and when this value will not meet the condition when n will be equals to 11 it will not meet the condition and hence it will end the loop so this is the concept of loop to repeat a process a certain number of times and this is repeating the process 10 times from checking the number 1 to 10 we are checking this n less than equals to 10 10 times for 10 values 1 2 and how this value is getting incremented because we are printing and again we are adding 1 to it so for printing any numbers you have to first see the first number and the last number if suppose you have to print 35 to 45 number between these numbers you have to print 35 till 45 so you have to set the value of n to the first number 35 and when you are adding going adding 1 to the value then you have to write the less than or equals to the last number and increment and when you are doing 45 to 35 it will be greater than or equal to and here it will be less than or equal to you can write equal to like this also so this much for today's class in the next video we will do flowchart in the reverse order 10 to 1